I decided to um, level grind off screen so now I am at level 4 so I should be strong enough to to, to go head to head with, with the first boss of the game so now we've entered the town of delicious as as this person said this is uh, delicious the town of the world's finest delicacies and yeah why don't we, we talk to, to these people in this town you'll find the finest foods from around the world but the mayor has taken all the food for himself I wonder why Let's keep asking for more information. If I resist the mayor, I'll be executed. But I'll starve if I don't get some food. What do I do? The Bell of Prism? Well, I heard that the mayor has one. My stomach... My stomach hurts. I shouldn't have eaten that strange grass. Yeah, it'll do that to you. <laughs> Alright, let's talk to him. I'm so hungry. Let's see. They say that the Bell of Prism is kept as a family treasure in a town called Silly City. Yes, that's Silly with the sea. There's a town called Silly City east of here. The people there are all stupid due to a strange sickness. How did that happen? We'll find out later as we progress through the game. This is the mayor's palace. You are probably weak from your long trip. Why don't you stay the night? You can rest a while and enjoy some delicious food. Let's see. People who have gone to the mayor's palace have never returned. I wonder what happens to them. My father is the greatest cook and delicious, but the mayor kidnapped him. I need your help. Fear not, because I will help. And also, I have pur I purchased uh, the crush punch off screen too, so it means more attack power. <clears throat> Excuse me. So right now let's go into the tool shop and purchase more items. Let's see, let's buy the Talisman B or Beta. I'll buy your Talisman A for 5 cent. Is it okay? Eh, sure, why not? Okay, and next we will buy these sweet buns. We're going to need them. Now the thing is, uh, you're only allowed to carry eight, eight items. Uh, well, eight of the same items. So, yeah, be aware of that. And that should be the last one. Yes, you cannot take any more. Yeah, that's the thing. Now we're introduced to another item, the Whirly Bird. Basically, what it does is it'll take you to the last town you visited. Yeah, that's basically what it does. Uh, when uh, once we pretty much uh, gone through the whole the whole map, there will be only one town that we're not allowed to to use the the, the Whirly Bird because there's no convenience store in there. That, that's a bit of a spoiler warning, so. So let's continue on. And let's visit the other places that we haven't gone to. Let's go right here. Welcome to the, the, the delicacy shop. Roasted slugs, ew. Boiled, boiled lizards, yuck. Salted spiders, gross. They're all very good. No, they're not. <laughs> There's nothing else to eat. So business is booming. No. Mm -mm. Alright, let's go to the next restaurant with a picture of a green burger. 
Welcome to McRonald's. Yeah. But there's nothing to sell. Yeah, McDonald's reference. Welcome to Nettie's. Well, we have nothing because of the mayor. Sorry. Yeah, Nettie's. A reference to Wendy's. Sorry about that, everyone. The phone rang, and I had to take a call. So let's continue on. And, ooh, who are you, sir? I am the mayor of Delicious. I will treat you all to the finest meals in Delicious. Gee, you're nothing like the people said you were. You're a pretty nice man. Boy, this food is excellent. Yeah, no kidding. Um, num, 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 num. Okay, I'm not gonna do that no more. Huh? I so suddenly feel sleepy. And we're asleep. Huh? I am in the prison? Hey! What's going on? <laughs> I will reveal my true identity. I am Tubba Tummy of the Yoma Clan. I'll cast a spell on you and change you into meatballs and eat you up. You are sick, man. Seriously sick. I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> yeah, you're very sick, dude. And, as you can see, we are in the prison. Let's talk to the people here. I heard that the amulet, too, will protect you from his spell. What's his spell? Well, when we get to, to the boss battle, you will know. Sorry, I didn't read that part. We said He said that he wants to fatten us up before eating us. As I said, he's sick. I'm the real mayor. Look at what's happened. So let's talk to this guy. I found a hole here, but I'm too fat to pass through. You boys should escape. Yeah, me and my invisible friend will escape. So let's continue on. And we are, we are out of the prison. And look, another house. I am the Savior Mouchy Mouse. Look at my face. What do y'all think the answer is going to be? Oh, you're great. I'll give you this amulet too, as a souvenir. Delicious is on the other side of the bridge in the north. Good luck. So yeah, we've now obtain the amulet 2 which will protect us from from Tubatami's spell so uh, in the last video I was supposed to explain uh, the, the mechanics in in these battles but I forgot so here's a, a brief t a tutorial on this B is the jump button okay a is, is the punch button, and when you move, uh, and while wa while running, you press the B button, and you'll do a little flip, in which they call this a kick. See? All right, here we go, and we've beaten the battle. So basically, uh, these battles are in the style of the first game, Kung Fu Heroes. Uh, later on in the, in the game, there will be turn-based RPG battles. So, look forward to that. And you pig lancers are really starting to annoy me. For the record, uh, that treasure chest, it was a, a skateboard. And, ooh, shuriken. Alright. And more dragon kicks. Trust me, I won't use them for anything except uh, turn-based boss, uh, boss battles. 
As I said in the first video, the Dragon Kick is one of the most powerful kicks in the game, but you are limited to how many you can use. And the only way to get those uh, um, Dragon Kicks is by... It's only through those battles only. If I find a, a treasure chest that contains those kicks and you, you get five per per chest. So. so now we've gone back into the ca in the castle or palace, however you want to call it. And I'm gonna have to pause this video because there's something I forgot to buy. So, so I'm gonna jump cut and be right back. And we are back. Or in this case, I am back. Sorry about that. So, um, I had to go back to the hotel and replenish my health. Because I wasn't going to waste these sweet buns. I'd rather have a complete set for this battle. Hold it, you sneaky rascals. I don't know how you escape. But as long as you know the secret, I won't let you get away with it. Come out, boys. And so the battle begins. There we go. Ow. I gotta stay away from that question mark. Because I already have the six M's I need. And I'm not gonna lose them. Alright. Go, 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 go. Alright. Next battle. Oh, that was close. Ooh, a bomb. Uh oh, this can't be good. Stars, protect me. Peace out. Ooh, that was a close one. Hi, my mom, that was a close one. All right, time out. Let's use a sweet bun, and we are back. And we got a skateboard. That is awesome. All right, let's keep going. Yes, these red pig lancers will shoot uh, projectiles. And with, with the, oh no, I fell off. Let's use another sweet bun. And w w with the scale shield, you should be able to deflect the, the projectiles. Okay, maybe they don't. Peace out. Um, one thing I've, I've got to mention about the about the red and blue grunts, the blue grunts they only punch, but they rarely do the jump kick. Red ones they punch and uh, they will do the 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 jump kick occasionally. So, let's continue on. What have you done to my men? Just you wait. I won't let you get away with this. You'll have to face me. Bring it on. Yeah. Because we have the, the amulet too. His spell won't affect us. However, if you do get hit by, uh, by that spell, you'll eventually become a sweet bun for, uh, for a few seconds, making you vulnerable to these jumping teeth. And if they catch you, it's an instant game over. So take out the teeth first, and just... Ah! That was close. Just keep on avoiding his sp his little spell. Just 
Just keep avoiding his his little projectile spell. Ow. Let's use another sweet one. Take out these jumping teeth. Ow. Uh-oh. Run, run. Oh, yeah, that was close. Okay, run, 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 run. Run. Use another sweet button. Now let's continue on. Let me get rid of these jumping teeth first. Gotcha. Boss battle completed. You have defeated the group of enemies. You have you obtained the Bell of Prism. Well, basically the story went like this. Tubba Tummy of the Yoma Clan went uh, went here into the town of Delicious, kidnaps the mayor, kidnaps anyone who entered, takes all the food, and leaves the, the city in famine, is what you call it? And basically, it was up to us to put a stop to it, which we did. I will treat you all to the finest meals and delicious. Mmm. Like I said, I'm not going to say that again. And because of all that food we ate, we have gotten big. To make matters worse, we can't get out. Because we're too, uh, we're too big to get out. It looks like you can't go out because you're too fat. That's mean, dude. Try pressing the A button repeatedly to exercise and lose weight. Alright. Okay, you should be able to go through. And on top of that... We have our second Bell of Prism. Two, bell, two bells down, five more to go. So now we leave the town of Delicious. Oh, there's more people to talk to. I'm so stuffed. Indeed you are. Alright, let's go back into these restaurants to see if there's any food. Welcome to McDonald's. Would you like some fries with that? That's it. Alright, Nettie's then. Welcome to Nettie's. Well, I ate them all, so we still have nothing. Sorry. Mm-hmm. It's, it's the same thing as before. Alright, so let's go. Let's leave the town. And this is where we end the part right here. So next time, we will continue our journey. See you next time. Take care and God bless.